Good morning, everybody, and we continue for another Ma'amar of Rabbi Yudah Ashlag. And today is Ma'ut Adat Matrata, the section called Atov Amuchlat, the absolute good. And uh, we know that every time you study from Bala Sulam, Rabbi Yudah Ashlag, there is an aspect within you that, that starts to change. And don't forget uh, 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 that we are also in Rosh Chodesh today. The beginning of the month of Tammuz. וכדי שלא לעלות המעניינים דברים ארוכים, נתמכתי על כל הכתוב עבר במערים הקודמים, בעיקר על המעבר במתן התורה, שהם הכולם כמו הקדמה לנושא הנשגב של אפלנון כאן, נדבר בקצרות תכלית הפשוטות שאין מובן לכל נפש. רבי אשלג is preparing us what is about to say, and he's asking us not to forget what we study before in the section called מתן תורה. And uh, that's how we're going to start to understand the absolute good. ובראשונה, in the beginning, צריכים להבין את הבורא יתברך אשר הוא הטוב המוחלט. We need to understand the creator, which is the absolute good. Wow, that's a name of the creator. The name of the creator is the absolute good. כלומר, שאי אפשר בשום פנים שבעולם אשר יגרום למישהו צר כלשהו. Meaning, if he, the creator, is the absolute good, he cannot cause pain suffering, sadness to any part of creation. שזהו מובן לנו כמו מושכל ראשון. And this is understood to us like a first understanding of what creator is. באשר השכל הבריא, מראינו בעליל את הבסיס לכל עושה רעות, שהוא מוגדר אך ורק ברצון לקבל. פירוש מתוך שלאות אחר קבלת תובנה שטובת עצמו, הוא מוצא את רצונו הזה בהערה לזולתו. שוב זה יוצא להערה לזולתו, תוך רצון לקבל את, את, את השטמתו עצמו. And from, with our brain, when we understand that the Creator is the totality of goodness for all people, so our healthy brain is, is helping us, the foundation here of all the people who do bad things. What is to do bad things? Ask Rav Ashlag. Ach verak beratzon lekabel. When a person is only busy with ratzon lekabel, only busy, what can I get from it? We all have ratzon lekabel. We all have desire to receive. Some of us are able to change part of it, some of us cannot change part of it. But the person is building from Ratzon Lekabel and Ratzon Latet, desire to receive and a desire to give. But if you totally Ratzon Lekabel only for yourself, it's been Rasha, it's been a wicked person. Because you want so much, the person wants so much to fulfill the goodness or the favor that he wants to receive, to complete himself, to be what he wants to be. So he's allowing himself to do bad to his Zulato, to his uh, fellow person. <coughs> Why? Because he needs to complete himself. Why? Why people are hurting each other? What's the reason they're hurting each other? They don't have enough. They don't have enough. Revelation. They believe they should have more money. They believe you should have more soulmate. They believe you should have more kavod. They're ready to hurt each other for that, what they believe they should have. But if they have it all, they don't have to hurt somebody. So why sometimes we've seen people that seem to have it all and still hurting people, ask Rabash. Like, he doesn't really ask it. He suggested as an answer. But we need to ask the question. Ela mitoch ergel. Ergel. How do you say ergel? Ergel. Something you're accustomed to. You feel you're accustomed to do a certain behavior, good or bad. And because of that, you do, you do it again. So you act selfishly, even if you have everything you need. Because 20 years ago, you were selfish all your life. And now you couldn't change that part. Asher ergel poter ota ata mikol siba chadasha. Kanoda. And you have customs and things that you're accustomed to. Negative things you're accustomed to. It's the biggest problem. Why? Because normally, a person who behaves bad, let's say a thief. A thief needs to steal bread every morning for his family, five kids. So now he steals bread every morning. He goes to that shop, 5.30 a.m., steal the bread. And that's going for a long, long time. Then that person, somehow there is a turning point in that person's life and mazal is changed and he has money 
and he continued to steal. What happened? The flavor of the stealing and the bread and the freshness, he can't let it go. He still needs to steal. So why is he stealing? Not because he doesn't have money now. Ergel. Ergel. You know, Ergel. Something that you're accustomed to do all the time, and you keep doing it. When you talk about Baruch, you can learn that he is a man of God. You don't want someone to help you to do anything else. And because the Creator is the first, and there is nothing beside the Creator before, and the Creator only wants to do good to His creature, and He doesn't need to add in nothing into Him, if it's clear that he doesn't have any desire to Now it's clear to us that He doesn't have any desire to receive, or any desire to complete itself, because it's complete. כיוון שאין לו שום בחינה של רצון לקבל, ממילא אין לו שום בסיס להריע למישהו. If he doesn't have within him no desire to receive for itself, that means he cannot cause any damage or any bad things to others. וזהו פשוט, תכלית הפשטות. It's a simple. ולא עוד, אלא שמקובל לו להתיישב על ליבנו, שתכלית הפשטות במושכל הראשון, it's clear to us, as we understand it before, שיש לו רצון להשפיע. It's all about giving, all about sharing. טוב אל זולתו. דהיינו לנבראיו, to his creature, שזה מוכרח לנו מכל הבריאה הגדולה שברא והערך לעינינו. And this is clear to us from all creation that is putting it in front of us. כי בהכרח שיש כאן בעולמנו בריאות שמרגישות. Among us there is people or creature that feel, או הרגשתו או הרגשה רע, there is people who feel something's bad, something's good. ואיזו הרגשה שהן מרגישות? What is that feeling that they feel? בהכרח שאני גרמת להם מהבורא יתברך. We are normally come into that conclusion that the reason I feel like this, that feeling itself came from the Creator, bless me. Now we prove to you that the Creator cannot do any negative thing to you. כמו שנתבהר, אם כן בכלל שכל הבריאות מקבלים ממנועית מערכת טובות בלבד. That in all creature, whatever God created, only receive goodness from the Creator. From here we learn that the Creator create uh, uh, the, the creature, the human, the animals, the stone, the minerals, the trees, only to do good to them. We learn from here the proof that Hashem, the Creator, blessed be He, have only ratzon l'ashpia, only desire to do good. טוב בלבד, ובשום אופן שבעולם שלא יצטרך באיזה חוק, חוקו, איזה גרם של עסק. From here we learn, it will be no chance that it will be any עסק, any damage coming from the creator, או סורו, אבל כן גדלנו אותו בראש השם, הטוב המוחלט. So what is the creator, formula of the creator? Creator, בורא, equal, אוקיי? Okay? הטוב המוחלט. When you say creator, in your mind, you have to think, הטוב המוחלט. Immediately, the Creator, a tova mukhlat, the absolute good. When you think Creator, Baruch Ata, a tova mukhlat. Okay, every time, Bore. When you say Bore Beri Periya Gefen, Bore equal a tova mukhlat, all the goodness. So you hold in the cup of wine, in the wine that you put inside, Bore a tova mukhlat, the absolute good. That's what we need to understand. And after she had done with that, we're going to take a look at the truth of the Mashit. That's what we're going to do with Barach. Now let's go down and look into the physicality and see how it's that part operate. Echo it, Barak Mashpeh Alayim, Rak Tov Bilvan. Five more minutes. Ashgachato it, Barak Yashgacha Matratit. The way that Hashem supervises us is Matratit. It's supervision with the goal, with the purpose. Ve muvan lanu. מכל מערכות הטבע המוצגים לעינינו. של כל בריאה קטנה, יש לשים מידה לתסוגים, דובר צובע החיים ומדבר, גם אם פרטם אנו מוצאים בהם השגחה מטרתית. If we look at all creation, mineral, vegetables, animals, and human, everything is השגחה מטרתית. Everything is a supervision coming from the creator with a purpose. כלומר, גידול איטי והדרגתי. Meaning everything is evolved Slowly. בדרך התפתחות של קודם ונמשך, and everything is coming from cause and effect, כמו הפרי על האילן, like the fruit of the tree, שמושך במטרה לטובה לסופו שיהיה פרי נעים בתוכניכך. 
Like the fruit, those of you ever work in a farm, until the fruit become a fruit, first you have a leaf, then a flower, then the flower turn into some, uh, uh, like a, a bulb, okay? That, that, that round, and then it's open to a fruit. I don't know if it's in English, too, but... Butnikai. Somebody was dealing with the trees and vegetables. But Butnikai is in English. Botanist. There is a name for it in English. Botanist. The botanist. Botanist. Wow. Kama matzavi ma'avrim alapri. How many levels that the fruit has to go to? The farmer. Let's say the farmer. But why do you have to make it so difficult for Israeli? Me'et shenira la'inam et biyatolu tachlit shugmar bishulo. It will be so. Uh, amazing when the moment that the leaves appear in the fruit tree until it become ready to be uh, ripe to be eaten. Nothing at the beginning of the fruit seem to be connected at all to what you're eating. It's actually make you angry. It's the opposite of what the fruit meant to be. When the food is really sweet in the end, like grapes, dates, it's more bitter in the beginning of the process, and it's more, doesn't look good, the beginning of the evolution. Also the animal, also the human. The animal, when they're getting older, they become more silly. The human, when become more older, becomes smarter. As they age, the human becomes smarter. And, and the human is, is, is damaged in the evolution part. Why? If you take a, 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 a calf, even if it's a young calf, it's a bull. I don't know if you ever saw a, a cow giving birth. It's amazing. They struggle a little bit outstanding, but a few hours later they're walking, they know where to get the milk. Unbelievable. 24 hours. They can walk around, Anna ve Anna, side to side. They know how to run away from something bad. What about the baby that's been born? It's like a piece of something lying on the floor. Can walk, can move, can crawl. Nothing. Nothing. If you bring a species from another planet to this world, Somebody smart from Mars, let's say, looking to understand Earth, and they look at the cow, was born four hours ago, ago eh, walking, know what to do, run away from fire, unbelievable. And they look at that baby, he will say <coughs> that human will never make it. <laughs> and when he look, like when you say Napoleon. <laughs> success of humor is. When you look at the cow, when you look at the, at the calf, it's just been born. He said, here we got a new Napoleon. So strong. If you measure the baby cow compared to the baby human, he look at the human, it's stupid. He will learn that Hashem, the Creator, blessed be He, supervised the universe in purpose, with a purpose. Meaning, Hashem doesn't look at the evolution part. He look at what's going to happen in the end with that creature. It's funny, the evolution cheat us. We don't really see from the beginning what's going to be in the end. It's the same with kids, by the way. A lot of, a lot of you look at children and you don't believe that that kids can be turning into whatever they can be turned. And I always tell parents, 
if your kids ever a soul like a bell of desire to receive for oneself alone, selfish, thinking about yourself, don't judge them. That can be developed into the best of the best. After all, you can't let go what you don't want. So if they want a lot, a lot, and they can let lot, and they can let go of a lot, that's tremendous. But very clearly, no more. Any chacham kebal on this own. Kerel bal nesion shlo zvulut zvulut tabriya b'kol zvulut chutra. That's the mutar v'chol agiyat tavuchot. For that reason, the Mishnah said, "Any chacham kebal on this own." There's nobody more wise than somebody with experience. Why with experience is more important than the wisdom itself? Because when you when you have experience, you know that that cow. That's not what's going to be your next teacher for next year in college, okay? It's actually that person that lying on the floor. In few years, that's going to be your professor in college. Not to be afraid of those uh, fearful pictures that we're holding in our brain. But in the middle of evolution, just to be busy with the final purpose of the creation, that it will be beautiful and pure, that going to the evolution. Now we know the supervision of Hashem, of the Creator, which is only supervision with purpose. That the whole evolution eventually bring out the final purpose of that evolution. So you cannot look at the situation uh, of a person and say, ah, there's no hope for that person. Of course, if the person is in the age of 40, you can judge, it's okay. I mean, you don't have to judge, it's bad for you, but you can have an analytical uh, moment when you understand that that person is not going to change. If they choose not to change at the age of 40, you know, they're not going to change. We are talking about when they are zero or one day old to 20 years old. So those of you who listen to the lecture say, oh my God, I'm 45 years old, there is still hope for me. Eh, not sure you have hope. You know, you have hope if you have teacher, a serious teacher, not just, uh, I have a teacher. Teacher will not listen to you. Not teacher that listen to you. If a teacher listen to you, that's mean you are the teacher, is the student. The teacher don't listen. The teacher fix you. The teacher tell you what you need to do right and how to stop doing the wrong thing. If your teacher is just listening to you all day long, you got yourself a good psychologist, you pay the psychologist $300, $500, they listen, but they don't change you. The same thing with the rabbi. If the rabbi just listen, 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 tell you nothing wrong with you, stay away from that rabbi. It's not for you. Stay away, run, run for the hill. Let's find out the, what is the idea of life with a purpose. What is the idea of life with a purpose? So the goodness of the Creator will not be revealed until the person will be totally developed and evolved. The Ashgaha that coming from the Creator is covered up with different wrap that seem to be like Kilkulim, seem to be like damage, but the truth of the matter is, it seems to be. The Creator only do good. But that goodness, goodness is covered with Ashgacha Matratit, with uh, supervision of the Creator, with a purpose to come, not for what's happening at the moment. You have a wonderful day, Chodesh Tov, till tomorrow.